Uh, another thing, again, in the um, education market at the moment, that if you've got businesses with a lot of computers and monitors, is network monitors that's coming out. Um, so you can have 10 uh, monitors and one server, or you can have 30 monitors and two servers. So instead of having to have a PC for every monitor, you've got a cost saving again with that kind of technology. So that's something new that um, LG's just brought out. This one, anybody familiar with visualizers? No, what a visualizer um, actually does, it's a, a little device, it's got a camera on a gooseneck and they, they capture images of um, 3D objects such as a Rubik cube up there or pages out of a book and, and this one that, here that she's doing, she's actually um, visualises there, she's actually got a mobile phone and she's uh, projecting it onto there so people can talk about what the products are but there's another little device there uh, called a wireless graphic tablet and what you can do is plug that into the side of the visualizer and that will allow you to annotate so again she could pick up the pen and annotate over that mobile phone that she's got there um, and explain what she's doing so um, using a jewelry example uh, if on your digital signage you wanted to show a lot of your um, products I'm just sort of thinking in places like um, um, H. Samuels, for instance, rather than people keep locking things up and bringing things out, you could actually have a little touch screen or a little monitor actually on the counter there, and they could put all their jewellery out, because you can get flatbed uh, visualisers as well, and have a flatbed visualiser, you could put the rings on, you could capture the images on them, and then have them displayed digitally onto a little uh, monitor. Uh, on the counter top of the jewellers and then people can flick right there without actually having the handy goods. So that, that's a little piece of technology there that's uh, now out and about. Oh, and that's just details of, of that particular one on there. These, uh, that particular magazine is free for anybody to download. We've done about five issues now of it. And um, we're also trying to work with local businesses or local um, education authorities so that if people have got, I mean, particularly like the Bellow restaurants, that was a two way thing. We wanted somebody to test the signage for us when we were doing it. And then we did a case study on them. And, um, you know, so they were happy because they got a piece of software. And we were happy because, um, you know, it gives us something that we can uh, do a case study with. So what we'd like to do today as well is just give you all a free license if anybody's interested. You can go and download it at repeatsoftware.com. There are training videos up there. It tells you what requirements you want on your PC to be able to run it. And um, when you want the license key, if you just drop me an email, we'll, we'll happily send you one. So that's me about done. Is there any questions? Or do you, if you want to ask about any other type of technology that you know, you're interested in. No, no, it's, I think everyone's, everyone's like happy about the free lights. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, because we're still developing it, um, you know, it's handy to have feedback and it's handy to be able to, uh, you know, to be able to show in different uh, places that the software can run in. Because we think it can, you know, it's value for any business at all. Um, it's just basically you're taking a printed poster and you're making it digital. Could I just ask you a question about mm -hmm. the, the restaurant one you got and obviously the big screen up yes. there. Have I seen somewhere where they, you, know, you go outside the restaurant and you're in a mall or wherever um, and it has it on the board there so they can change the rest of the menu every day and also change the price quite when they want to. Yeah, I, I, I yeah there used to be a printer poster. Yeah. And, um, is, that, is that the same technology I'm thinking yeah, of? It's, yeah, it's a similar technology. Yeah. Yeah. It, basically, what you're looking at here is a piece of software mm. and it's designed to go on the screen or through a projector. Got it. Um, but there are companies that actually do do the digital stands, as you say. And I saw some as well when we went across to Tenerife. They've got some with little LED lights on. 
and they were all like done on the board coming across what the menu was right. and then they, they'd also got the images as well but I think what's happened there is as a company's taken stands they've incorporated the software and then they, they're just selling it as a whole package, a package. but I think it's Rivermead that do them actually yeah. thank you yeah any other questions well in which case um, another refreshment break and from now until three um, please